Yeah? Yep. <laughs> hey guys, it's Friday. You know what that means. It's time for your free back rubs and maybe even a free front rub. It's live stream Friday. I have another segment. I'll hold that off for one second. Let's do a couple records that just came in. It's a good collection of rare and new and restocks. The buy marks, members of the bog people. This is a tour pressing. Only 104 made screened covers, numbered at 91. This is a good band. And then on the other hand, there's Rancid. This is their first 7 inch on Lookout. <laughs> I'm such a dick. Do you disapprove or do you, do, you, do you disprove? I don't know. It's a split with Ungrund. Sounds like something you find in your pants. Discard, 7 inch. You know, I've always wondered something. Who killed Spiky Jacket? I don't even know. Do you guys know? Call me if you know. Ectoplasm. Okay, this, let's, it's a good segue. Here's a new thing we're going to do. Um, I very rarely go to the movies. I went to the movies, I saw Ghostbusters. And I saw Star Trek Beyond, and the ectoplasm makes me think of Ghostbusters. Um, I'm not going to ruin it, no spoilers. It was an excellent movie. I laughed out loud throughout the entire movie. I, for one, liked it better than the original. Super fun. It was an awesome movie. Could it just be my mood? I thought it was a great movie. On a scale of one to five yeah yeahs, I gave it four solid yeah, 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 yeah! Awesome movie. Go see it. Star Trek Beyond, if you know me, I love Star Trek. I am who I am because of Star Trek and punk rock. The new Star Trek was good, but I did have problems with it. It was very action. Um, and Star Trek really isn't like an action type of thing. It's more, you know, dialogue and thinking and story. The story was good. It was, it was too action in the sense that the action scenes were dark, which I hate, and too jittery. Like, you can't really see what's going on. And there were a couple things that I have problems with with the storyline. Uh, it wasn't as good as the last one or two of the new. It's good. It's worth seeing. It's worth paying full price for, but I was a little disappointed. On a scale of one to five yeah yeahs, I gave it three and a half. A yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Three and a half yeah, yeahs. Okay. Back to records. Appalachian Terror Unit. Everyone loves these guys. I still haven't listened to them. I have a couple friends that said I would like them. But I still haven't had time. I don't know. I always forget about it. Underdog refresh on green. Green vinyl. Green. Uh, Mob 47. This one is out of print. I think it's a European pressing. Oh, here's the record someone was looking for. Damn it. I looked for this record. It wasn't on the floor. Gloss. Ricks? Rixie? Ricks? Ricks. This one, and that one. How about that? They're coming on tour. They're out here on tour. No fucker. Don't know this band, but I love the name. Chaos Channel. No idea what this one is. It's cheap. Punk and Disorderly. Not the compilation. It's a band. Japanese? Maybe. Oh, it's, they're doing covers. Peter and the Test Tube Babies, Conflict, Kraut, ooh, I love Kraut, Kraut, and others. Hava, Heva, Tom Lyle, Government Issue, if you want that record, you wanted the last one, if you want it, you can have it, my friend. Final Noise Attack. This one has uh, Defiance, Despair. Who else is on that? There's four bands on there. Oh, Defiance. I said that. Why am I yelling? Reason why. <laughs> Wide angle. Condemned and despair. Plastic Smile, another Japanese import. Leprosy. My dick had leprosy. That's why it fell off. Luckily, it's like a lizard's tail. It grows back. Bigger and better. Man, you cannot beat the heat. But you can eat my meat. Final Assacre or Massacre, you decide. If you buy the record, you can do whatever you want. You can cross off the uh, M and make it Assacre. 
code vinyl. Finally, it's in. That's what she said. The new Descendants. It's good. I listened to it. You know, I still really like Everything Sucks. That's a great record. This one isn't as good as that, but it's good on the first listen. I usually don't like a record the first time, but there were a few um, good standout songs. It's The Descendants. It's worth getting. It's good stuff. Repress, Blink-182. Boot up. Yep, yeah, boot up. Cursed. Here is your first money back guarantee. Whoop. Bad Brains. This was originally released in 82 or 83 as a cassette only on the label Roar, which they only did cassette releases back then. Awesome record. If you like Rock for Light, this is vintage Bad Brains. Money back guarantee. And we got in more. And I've heard from two people, the new adolescents. It's good. It's very comparable to the last couple adolescents. Don't expect the first record, but you, how could you? Expect what they're doing lately. Good. Good stuff. Misery. You know, I forgot who's in this band. There's a couple people from other hardcore bands like Terror. I don't know if it's Terror. Uh, Google it and you'll find out. Brand new. Distillers. Restock. Uh, more Descendants, got enough of those. Ooh, these sell all the time. The last two or three times we had them, they sold out that day. Vice Squad, this is their last record. Uh, Becky wasn't singing for them at the time. This is Leah. She has an excellent voice. Just as good, if not better, than um, Becky's voice. She can really, I mean, nothing against Becky Bondage. Awesome singer. She has an awesome voice, too. Good record. Smart Alex, repress. Everybody loves the addicts. Everyone loves dystopia. I don't love dystopia. They're nice guys. Todd, you're a great guy. I just, whatever. I'll shut up now. Dystopia, clear vinyl, brand new Dayglow abortions. There is a mom joke in there somewhere, but once again, it's hot. Did I offer about eating my meat? Major accident. These guys are great. I saw them with the addicts and the bad brains at Fenders and well Bad Brains were the best band by far but Major Accident I liked them better than the Addicts at least that night awesome band if you like the Addicts you'll love Major Accident Clockwork Orange type of band this is really interesting uh, I always thought the Bad Brains were the first all black punk band they aren't pure hell they were in Philadelphia 76 or 77 uh, this is a UK pressing of their old stuff it's actually really good you have to give these guys so much credit for being a punk band back then, for being an all-black punk band. Oh, my God. You can only imagine the crap they went through. Speaking of going through crap, the legendary Dead Kennedys. I love this record. This is their second record, Plastic Surgery Disasters. It's as good, if not better, than the first one. No, it's not better. It's just as good. It's great. Must have. Bedtime for Democracy. This is much more... Hardcore. They really picked up the pace on this record. Good. Uh, Frank and Christ. Is that Frank and Christ? Yeah. Awesome record. You'll like that. This one, get it while you can. It's a European import bootleg. This has Danzig on it. It's a radio broadcast from 82 or 83. 83, sorry. Um, yeah, from Detroit, Michigan. Coral, Detroit. Toxic Holocaust. Municipal Waste. I'm sure it's on colored vinyl. I don't know. It's sealed. So shut up. Did I mention about eating my meat? Because you can't beat the heat. Here we go. This one has some more restocks and rare. This one. Get that. They sell very quickly. The distributor's almost out. Gives them Japanese legends. Frampted. Pre. Uh, Death in June. Crisis. They're a cool band. Late 70s, early 80s. Punk. And then they got, you know, a little bit different. Another legendary band. Rudimentary P9. The Mighty, the one and only SSD Control. Awesome band. I saw them play at Santa Monica with GBH and the Effigies the first time they came out. I'm not sure when that was. Early 80s. Awesome. All bands destroyed. And then they turn hippie. What? What were you thinking? Bad. Bad SSD. Motorhead. European import. The first Dayglo Borshans. 
out of the womb. That's a repress. Flesh world, UK import. No, no, that's not a UK import. The next flesh world is. Speaking of flesh world, did I mention you could eat my meat? How about that? This is the day of abortion everyone knows, and that's probably their best record, I think. Wolf Brigade. Oh, woo! That was stupid. No, go back. Total control. How would I know that? I don't know. I just guessed. I'm just making it up. Don't be a fucking spaz about it, bro. Okay? Just take it easy. Spasmo. What? You didn't hear me? I said don't be a spaz about it. Dick licks. Okay. <sighs> One last time. Spaz. This is Beach Gulag. They just sent these records, guys. If you're watching this, please send me an email. It's Gulag Beach. Gulag Beach. So, it's hot. Uh, email me, because I'm not really sure what to charge for these. Don't just send me something and have no letter. God, that's a big pet peeve of mine. Siege. That's a repress. It's probably on colored vinyl. This is another band everyone loves. It's more like that funky stuff. If you like Andrew Jackson Jihad, maybe, or Apple, I think. Limp Wrist, that reminds me, August 13th, which is a Saturday, here at the store. We're having a free movie debut of the Los Crudos documentary. Bring your own chair, bring your own popcorn. We're going to watch it in the parking lot. Get here early, like around 3 or 3.30, because with me on the couch, live, Shattered Faith. The legends, I'm very excited about that. Also very excited this Monday in the studio, also known as the record store, also known as the couch, Red Death, here. Stop by, hang out, give them a hand job, anti-product. Out of print. Another crisis, this is the collection, this is all their stuff. Has their seven inches, that's a good record. Double LP, Mindset. Leave no doubt. Dr. No. Appalachian Terror Unit, Gatefold. We don't need them, that's the name of the record. Urban Waste. Here's another, uh, that might sell pretty quickly, another European repress, limited repress, Zeke. Whoops. Okay, here we go into some of the harder to get stuff. A lot of Japanese imports and European imports. Disarm, discography, double LP. Make sure you guys call or go online. These are all online. Okay, you can check them out right now. But I would suggest if you do want them, call me up. Like now. 909-944-1778. That way you'll get them. One of my all-time favorite songs is playing right now. Cron Gens Outlaw, which we have on. We did somewhere. We have it for sale. Must have. Money back guarantee. Love Cron Gen. Love this song. Probably a top ten all-time of my personal favorites. Yata, Yalta High Life. Full of Hell, colored vinyl. This is kind of a cool colored vinyl, I'll show you. Half clear, half white, like my semen? No. Original reggae stuff, the, not the Blues Brothers, the Blues Busters. 1969 or 1968, I forget. It's one or the other. We've got a couple. You wanna bang my dong? Hey, T-Rex. Nick, God damn it. You tell me. Necrophobic. Necrophobic. We also got in some really cool cassettes today. Thank you to Mark and Chaz. Uh, oh, uh, including unisex. Marlon, I know you wanted that, and a couple other people asked for unisex. We got a, uh, got a few of those in. Escorbuto, The Nerves, Another Crisis, Blitz, when they kind of turned different, shall we say. Electrocutioner, 7-inch. That sells. Strangers, that one sells really well. I haven't listened to it. Verdugo Records. This is really good. It's the newest record from the business. Surprisingly good. I like it. It's typical business stuff, which is a compliment. 
Alienation, Tiny, thank you. You told me to get this. Another one of those bands that has members of somebody like Fury. I don't know. Google it. I'm not really sure. I shouldn't say, but I know there's members of that. And uh, this is Dana's friend Marcel. I listened to a couple songs. It was good. Colored vinyl. European import. Cheap to 90. Thanks, guys, by the way. Uh, regulators. Programmers, I'm sorry. Programmers. I'm hot. <laughs> it's like 100 fucking degrees out. Did I mention the thing about my... Uh, I did, right? About my meat. Dawn of the humans. Oh, here's one that you guys might want if you're into like that more uh, death rock type of stuff. She's one of the singers of um, Strawberry Switchblade. How about that? Yeah, her. That's the girl. She came in and dropped these off personally. Really? No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she did. Zionos. <laughs> Got really excited about that. <laughs> yeah. She was riding a Pegasus. Crazy spirit. Do la misma, la misma. Oh, and also, guys, I'm sure, well, maybe you haven't heard, because it just happened yesterday, anti nor League could not get their visas to come in. So if you bought a ticket from us, come in anytime. There's no rush. We'll give you a refund. I'll let you know if and when they reschedule. The show that's selling out quickly, Ill Repute Youth Brigade, August 27th. It's the benefit for Big Frank. He's a former Golden Voice bouncer. I mentioned him last week. Good guy. Manager at Zed Records. Uh, it's selling really, really well. Igby, if you're watching this, we can use more tickets for it. Excels on it. All these uh, Final Conflict. This is a killer lineup. I guarantee you will have a great time. It's at a really good place. It's in L.A. It holds 700 people, but I still I expect it to sell out or come close to selling out. So please come in, get your tickets. Speaking of tickets, tomorrow night at Club 1650, the mighty Voodoo Glow Skulls. We still have a few left. They're only $15, cash only, as always, cash only on all of our sales. Um, and once again, this Monday, Red Death on the couch with Dr. Strange. August 13th, make a mental note or write it down on your dick. You two ladies on your dick. We're going to have the Los Crudos documentary movie here in the parking lot. Projected on the wall for all to see. Bring your own chair. Bring your own popcorn. We'll have some fun. We'll dance. A bit crazy after we see Shattered Faith live. No, I'm not going to play, I'm sorry. Being interviewed live. If you have any questions you want to submit it, please let me know. And now, here he is, the person you've been waiting for, my friend, not yours, he's my friend, Canyon! <laughs> Dude, that's called a praying mantis. Who's on the phone? Dance us out, bitch. Oh, I, don't, I don't know. It's what's too spinning, hot. Right? It's oh, too hot. Just it. I was like, oh, all right. You're really disappointing the internet I'm, right I'm now. disappointing the internet. I'm super pissed. It's okay. <laughs> Do the robot. That's not the robot. What are you? Canyon's Dude. way overheated right I'm, now. Yeah, I got no music. I'm not jamming. Uh, I'm sorry, internet. Uh, I didn't mean to disappoint you. Who are you going to see tonight? Oh, Brian Ferry. That's cool. Okay, which one do you want to get? You want the adolescents. I already held that for you. Yeah, it's a bootleg. It's great, though. No, it sounds really good. See, someone's getting your record right now, you motherfuckers. This guy right here from New York. Fuck. I'm telling everyone that they better call. You know what else we got in? Are you watching right now? Can you show them? Go back there. You're going to shit your pants over this. An original. It's okay. Stupid computers. Hey, I was dancing. In my head, I'm still dancing. It's minor threat. 
in my eyes original 179. Google it. They go for like two something. No, I don't blame you. My buddy wants it over there. I just wanted to see. Uh, oh, here's something else I want to show people. Thanks to Canyon. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry, Steve. Is it? <laughs> if you think it's funny now, wait till I zip my pants. You can smell the odor of fish all the way to New York. I don't mean giant. <laughs> oh, yeah. Question. The shirts. Oh, you're good. Yeah, what about it? So, is hey, she in that Orange is the New Black? Record, that's, what, uh, that's what Kenya was saying. It's the lady from Orange is the New Black. I don't know which one, though. This that's, one. that's the only girl right there. Oh, yeah, her. Orange is the New Black, yeah. Her. Yeah. She doesn't talk at this. She doesn't talk. She doesn't talk? She's silent? Yeah, on Orange she, is the New is Black. Is she deaf? She no. <laughs> She's a mute ass fucked up. This guy. Kenya's buying Van Halen. Really? Chucky, awesome Chucky has Van Halen. Yeah, look at it. All these fucking Van Halens came in. All this shit. Fucking this one. Yeah, see, look at that. What? Look at what Chucky's doing. He's got the police. Boat police. Uh-huh. Van Halen. That's the jam right there. Thanks, That's the jammy right there. That's the shizzle. That's the shizzle. We got rid of the adolescence, people. Um... We got our adolescence, Zeke, oh, and SSD control, and you guys got a call, see? That guy was all the way from New York, and that's the only Zeke that we had. I might be able to get more, maybe, not sure. Oh, and this one, we do have another one of these. That's another money-back guarantee. If you like hardcore, Minor Threat, Necros, Zero Boys, you'll love this record. You already know that. Such a legendary band. Awesome band. Uh, oh, and the adolescents. Okay. How about uh, that, Steve? Are you still watching? Instagram contest. We Instagram only have, contest. We have one yeah, entry. Dear God, listen, guys. We've had thousands of people yeah. see the yeah, yeah video, and you win stuff for it, and only a few people have actually submitted. Literally one. One person, so that person's going to win. Just submit something. I don't care if you do a yeah, yeah, or no, no, or maybe, maybe. Do whatever you want. But your odds of winning, if you submit, are very high because you have very little competition. You know, take take 30 fucking seconds. Put down your Pokemon. Pokemon, more like poke your mom. Oh, wow! Where's my slide whistle? I forgot my slide whistle. Damn it. Anyway, submit. Yeah, yeah. Hashtag, yeah, yeah. You can win big or small. Did I mention about the back rubs? Come on in for a back rub. And the front rub. Either way, it's free. Okay, go away. It's hot.